Park. Melissa Mitchell has taken the art scene here in Atlanta by storm, and now she has a global partnership with Spanx, a company known for supporting women entrepreneurs. CBS 46's anchor Karen Greer spoke with Mitchell about the relationship and what it's like to be an artistic pioneer. And that's what my book turned into. Melissa Mitchell lives her life as boldly and colorfully as the art she creates. I think that because my desire and my passion is so strong that whatever I do turns into something magical. From magazines and fashion runways to art shows and murals throughout Atlanta, Mitchell's art is popping up everywhere. All serious accomplishments for a self-taught artist. Growing up, I had never known of a famous black female artist, definitely not a muralist, definitely not a black textile designer. So I feel like I'm a first of my kind. Her unconventional journey began four years ago when she was looking for an outlet to ease her pain from the death of her father, Michael. Started using just a, a regular magic marker. I said, wow, it'd be dope if I put some color in this. I sat back and I was like, this might be something. That something recently caught the eye of Spanx founder Sarah Blakely. And so every time I look at TV, I am reminded of my Spanx win. When Mitchell's art was chosen as the winner of the Illuminate Her Bra design contest. It's such an invigorating feeling to be a part of an empire built by a self-made billionaire who is so, she's such a proponent of women entrepreneurs, even the contest itself. She wanted a female artist that was hungry for success and it's an honor to carry on that name. Mitchell says as a child growing up in Miami, she always knew she'd do something big. She just wasn't sure what. Now her empire includes a lucrative business, ABL Creations, where she sells clothing, art, books, bags, and head wraps. You make it bigger. Of which celebrity actress Lupita Nyong'o is a huge fan. Seems like you have a lot of ideas, but what do you see for yourself at the very top? I want to go around to hospitals across the world and paint rooms that when people are transitioning, whether they're coming into the world or leaving the world, I want the rooms to be colorful. Um, I remember my dad passed away. All I remember are white walls. And it was such a dismal feel. It reminds me as a woman that our words can be like honey or they can be like poison. Big ambitions for a woman who never saw herself as an artist. I'm just getting started. Can you believe this is the same little girl from Miami? I can't, but I had to learn how to stop saying I can't believe this is happening and start saying this is what God wanted for me. I think that over time, I'm still in awe, even that we're sitting here today, um, how things have manifested and unfolded. But when you dream big, life literally gives you something bigger than that. Mitchell's winning design with Spanx will launch in the spring. For CBS 46 News, I'm Karen Greer. Her art, like, makes me happy. I know, it's very right? colorful, it's abstract, colorful. beautiful. Yeah, it is, nice.